pass by with my little eye. What is going on guys? Hope you're all having an amazing day. It's currently 5 p.m. right now And I know we're just getting the vlog started, but to be honest I was in this inventory room Reorganizing everything as you can see we have small bins over here. These are stuff that needs to go out Then we have bins over here. We're gonna do small medium large XL This pile is strictly but button-up t-shirts or not button-up shirts but like dress shirts I'm going to do a flash sale on these. It's going to be $15 shipped. Uh, that video will be coming soon. The video that you'll probably either see before or right after this is this video. This is the $10 and $20 shipped. Uh, this is joggers for $20 and t-shirts for $10. Then this bin will be the third video you guys will see. This is all collared shirts. Vintage Tommy Hill figure like the color block and polo Ralph Lauren. These are going to be $15 shipped. Then all of this is new inventory for the past week that I need to upload. All of this is inventory that's been there. And then, as you can see, we hung up everything. I've literally been in here the whole entire day with my boy just reorganizing everything. I need to get a couple more bins to finish that off. But we're actually going to go to Plato's Closet. I just saw they just put a bunch of stuff on clearance. We're going to check out what they have. So let's get it. I'm finally getting to use my Paige jeans. And honestly, they are so comfortable. Like, forget any other jeans. Forget the $6 jeans. I got these for $20 at Plato's Closet. As you guys saw, we found three pairs. I'm keeping all three pairs. These are 100% my favorite jeans. Like, if you guys have a pair of Paige jeans, or if you don't, definitely try to snag a pair. Uh, the ones I got are Paige Lennox, L-E-N-N-O-X, I believe. Super soft denim, almost feels like joggers, so 100% recommended. And no, this isn't a paid advertisement by Paige Jeans. They're just really soft. I've never felt like soft jeans like this, so I don't know. I'm, I'm just surprised, I'm surprised. Or it could be the fact that I was using Target jeans, so I wasn't used to like nice quality jeans, but even like True Religion jeans. True Religion jeans are pretty expensive. They actually be more expensive than Paige jeans, but like I said, these feel like joggers, super nice quality, so shout out to them. It's so weird to be walking to Plato's Closet at night, but let's see if they got anything. First find out tonight is like this Burberry look-alike shirt. So as you can see, it has zippers on the side. This brand is Hudson. And I just found this Cheetah 10 Deep size medium shirt. 10 Deep on the back. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get this though. Found this Huff jacket, brand new with packs on tags, 70 bucks. Open 24 hours. Wow, this Lacoste sweater is ridiculous. Embroidered alligator right there, you got it Lacoste. Got this Cats, Cool Cat. I'm guessing it's a collab with Lacoste and Cool Cats. It is 20 bucks though, so we're gonna do some research on this. Got this Adidas shirt in like this tinfoil design. Unfortunately, there's tons of cracking. And we got a bunch of stuff already. Got these silver Pumas. They don't have much good shoes. Those were here last time. Red Van. Odd Future. We got these Jordan 1s. I'm not sure the name, the gold navy. These are a size 11 for 45. Vintage Polo Ralph Lauren Pocket Tee in the peach and white XL. Guys, I just found the craziest A-Life piece I have ever found. This is 100% staying in the personal collection. Oh my gosh, this thing is sick. Guys, I am so hyped. Oh my gosh, did you see that A-Life sweatshirt? It, it is a size large and staying in the personal collection. We struck gold. We got that Polo Stripe Vintage Pocket Tee, size XL. We got that Lacoste cardigan, which that cardigan I'm probably gonna keep as well. A lot of this stuff I'm gonna keep because Wow, we struck gold like literally I was sitting after like redoing my whole entire room just relaxing on YouTube It was five o'clock. I was like, you know what? Let me go to Plato's closet and it was triple points today So they have a reward system that you get every after ten dollars you get one point I already had a 20% discount So I used 20% off on this and then they gave me triple points on this purchase So I got another 20% off. I am so Hyped guys. All right, I might go to the other one because I feel like we're gonna strike gold again I'm gonna see how far the maps are. Well, I decided to make it to the other Plato's closet Let's hope we strike gold again. I got like this Rasta satin jacket. I believe it's a size extra small though. 
two extra small, so that's like a one inch. Undefeated crew neck. Got this plate cloth navy with like a tribe at the bottom. Andy Warhol collab. Got this size medium Versace collection with the V. 10 deep long sleeve with like the cheetah print. We saw the short sleeve version at the other Play-Dohs. Just found this fake off-white bootleg off-white. That's crazy with like tags and everything. I've never heard of this brand, but look, it's like a Go Yard fake bootleg box logo. Hey, big. Got this vintage V Guess. I'm not sure if this is vintage or a reprint like Urban Outfitters. And this is why I say never take a day off. Literally, I wasn't gonna go thrifting today. I was gonna stay home. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do the sale, the $10 sale video, and that'll be it. But then I was just laying in bed. I was like, you know what? I feel like there's gonna be something at Plato's Closet. I just have a feeling. And what do you guys know? We went to two Plato's Closet and struck gold on both. Obviously, the first one, we 100% struck a home run. The second one, we definitely got some good stuff. We got that guest vintage. I don't know if it's a reprint or if it's the vintage. I'm pretty sure it's the reprint, like the Urban Outfitters. But even so, at Urban Outfitters, they sell it here for like 50 bucks. So, hey, that was a good cop. A lot of stuff is for personal, but I will help you guys out on a couple items that won't be my size. So let's go on home. I'll show you guys the full recap. Well guys, today's haul was honestly so unexpected and it was probably one of the best, well obviously it's the best of 2017, but to be honest it's probably close to the 2016. I find fire things all the time, you know, here and there, something's there, but to be honest I've never walked into two stores and left or felt so accomplished that I did today. And as I said, I was going to take today off, I reorganized this whole entire sneaker room with my friend and I was just in bed watching YouTube. I saw Plato's Closet posted a thing on Instagram that you get three times the amount of stamps on your card. I was like, you know what? It's five o'clock. I'm not doing anything. I didn't go thrifting yesterday. Let's do it. Let's go over there. What do you guys know? I find it today. Usually I pick like two of the best items for like my thumbnail. No idea what pieces I'm using for the thumbnail just because everything in here is 100% fire. Some bad news on that. I'm probably keeping about 90% of these things, but I'll still show you guys just so that way. I could have copped a lot more things, but I didn't. I only copped a little bit for personal. Some things I'll probably end up getting up to you guys or helping you guys out on some things, but a lot of it is personal. So jumping into today's haul. So we went to Two Plato's Closet. We got the vintage tag size XL. Polo Ralph Lauren with like the peach with the white pocket tee. Eyes XL, Odd Future. Black with the pink donuts. Every time I find Odd Future shirts, it's usually like a medium. Like the last one I found was the light blue one. Same design as that, the pink donuts. And I think it was a medium, so it's kind of cool to find a large or extra large. This piece I ended up getting, and low key I actually might keep. It's very heavy, so it's going to be good for the winter. But it is a Lacoste cardigan, and it is a collab with this thing called Cool Cats. If it will focus right there. And if you see, it still has the Lacoste tag, so it makes me think that this is still brand new. I wouldn't think anyone want to wear this with that on it. So we got the blue with the red. Got the alligator patch right there. Below that, we have Lacoste with the pocket. On the left side, we have Cool Cats. And then the thing. It says this is a number six and they labeled it a medium. So I'm gonna try it on, but if I had to guess, it probably looks like a large. We're gonna save this piece for the end. This piece, again, I was totally surprised to find this. This is a size large. I'm probably gonna end up keeping this because I don't personally have a guest shirt. I believe this is a reprint. If you notice, it says guest on the inside. I believe vintage guest has a guest tag. It's not screen printed like this. Is there a year? I don't see a year. So if I had to guess this came from Urban Outfitters or a store like that, maybe even guess. I think guess might have reprinted these shirts. But these shirts go for like 50 bucks. So it's kind of crazy that we got it for $8, $10. So as you guys know, I got that off-white shirt from a buddy of mine, totally for free. Not sure if it's legit, not sure if it's authentic. A couple people have saw it and they said, dude, this is legit. A couple people have saw it and they said, Eh, it's a it's a hit or miss to be honest. I got it for free So 100% thanks to my friend for helping me out. I don't have any off-white clothing 
and I probably won't have any off-white clothing. I can't really see myself spending $350 on a t-shirt. I did spend quite a amount of money on Gucci and Supreme, but that's because I love Gucci. Off-white, I just, I don't know. But it's funny because I kept asking, I was like, yo, where did you get that, where did you get that? And he wouldn't tell me, he wouldn't tell me, so, which makes me believe it might be fake. But I found 100% legit off-white fake. 100% legit off-white fake. So if you see, it doesn't even say off-white. Like you would think if that they would be copying or like, why am I blurry, come on. You would think that if they would be like faking a shirt that they would actually put off-white tags in it. But they have white on the bottom, white on the side, white on the back, and then the long sleeves. I am gonna be keeping this um, just because it's a bootleg. It's... Bro, stop it! It says it's a 2XL, but bootleg runs very, very small, so this is like a size large. But still crazy to find a Plato's Closet, you know, bootleg off-white for $10. Another bootleg, which, I mean, it's probably not bootleg because it doesn't say Burberry on it at all. But if you guys notice, this is the Burberry print. And just to compare... You guys know I have my authentic Burberry shorts, so let's just compare. And if you notice, it is pretty damn. This is a different material, this is like a nylon, so this is gonna be different coloring. But that is crazy, even down here, you see, it's like the same thing. So we have this size medium. The brand is named Hudson, I believe. This black with, like I said, the Burberry like print on top. You have the Burberry prints going down the bottom with two zippers on each side. They do work. Is it like a pocket? It's not a pocket, but they do work. They're just like zippers there. Yeah, for fashion. So you see that? I will end up selling this just because it's a medium. And I'm sure one of you guys are going to want to stunt with this uh, Burberry. This is brand new with PacSun tags. And the original price is $69.95. This is a Huff zip-up jacket, size medium. Show you guys that. If it will focus, focus, focus. Guys, go. So we have this black zip-up. It says, open 24-hour, the Huff Management Co. 1984. Again, brand new with tags, never worn. On the back, we have the 24 hours, the same logo, just bigger. Open 24 hours with the KISS logo, Huff Management. This I will be selling since it is a medium. Versace Co. size medium. Got the gray. And like this is like a nylon mixed with like velvet. I don't, I don't, it's really hard to explain but there's two different materials on this V. And it is Versace Collection. This is legit Versace Collection. This is not a bootleg. So size medium. This was another thing, like, I was so surprised, like, with the off-white seeing. This is by Hey Big. It's a size 2XL, but I tried it on in the store, and it fits me, so I'm gonna keep it. As you see, it is a Goyard box logo, which is kind of crazy. It doesn't actually say Goyard. It doesn't actually say Supreme, but you guys know Supreme New York is probably the only people that do the box logos. So to find a Goyard, hey, I'm gonna be stunting. And for the final piece, the grail piece, the hyped piece, like, when I saw this, I was speechless. Like, I had three items in my hand already, and I was like, where do I put these down? Like, I, I am so hyped, I have to get this. And I even asked the owner, or like, the person working, I was like, guys, I'm so hyped you had this. She's like, yeah, it's probably expensive, isn't it? I was like, I don't even know if it's expensive, but I know that it's rare because I haven't seen one of these and it is just so branded, it is crazy. So without further to do, we got this A-Life Olympic crew neck. We have the Olympic stripes going all the way on the sleeve that wrap around. On the right sleeve, we have MIM Olympic Ventus? I don't even know how to pronounce this to be honest, I'm sorry. But Olympic. On the back, we have NYC, A-Life, 
A-Life all embroidered in like this satin material. Then we got this like, I guess what is this, uh, boxing gloves or hockey gloves, I can't tell, with a girl. So this piece is a size large, it is 100% staying in my collection. So hyped on this, I don't care what people offer me, $350, I'm keeping this 100%. So if you guys, I mean, honestly, I would hope you guys enjoyed this video, but if you enjoyed this video, smash the thumbs up button, subscribe if you're not subscribed. We're very close to 4,000. Well, I think we're at like 3,600 or 3,700, but we're close to 4,000 subs. The next milestone is going to be 5K subs, then 10K and so on. This year I'm going to be doing a lot of collabs, so hopefully we get some more viewers. I'm not sure if this video is going before or after. It's most likely going to go for my liquid sale. My liquid sale, I'm going to be doing $10 each shipped a shirt, which is pretty much $5 a shirt, $5 shipped. And I'm going to be doing joggers, $20 shipped, which is pretty much $10 a pair of joggers, $10 with shipping. So make sure you guys come back for that. It should be up probably tomorrow morning since this video is going up. I was going to post it today, but I don't have enough time to upload the whole inventory. I've got about halfway, um, so it's not up. It's not live. It's going to be private right now. Also, this stuff or the mediums that I'm selling will not be listed. As you guys know, I have to list all of these as well. So you should see these up in the next two days or so. So I'll see you guys tomorrow, and don't forget guys, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it guys. A girly I can get cause she don't get too many likes, a curly headed cutie I could turn into my wife, wait that means forever ever, hold up never mind.